Oh my God. It's not Joe Bocabella. That's Mocha Joe. Mr. Bocabella, I understand at one point you were in the coffee business. Yes, I was. It was called Mocha Joe's. Maybe you heard of it. Ever have a problem with anybody? Not really. Normal stuff until one day Larry David came in. Could you tell us what happened? He started complaining. My scones were like muffins, too soft. Yeah, my tables soft. were wobbly, and that my coffee was cold, which it was not. No, Objection, was. Your Honor. It was relevance. Cold. Goes to motivation, Your Honor. I'll allow it. And it ended there? I wish. He came back in, and he said he was opening up what he called a spite store. Oh, here we a go. A coffee shop right next door to my store, Mocha Joe's. He was trying to put me out of business. This almost sounds fantastical. <laughs> it got even worse. I got a call in the middle of the night that Mocha Joe's was on fire. And when I got there, he was standing there, watching my beans burn. What did you do? He burned my beans. I didn't burn your beans. You burned my beans. Joey Funkhauser started that fire with his big new peanuts. <laughs> David, shut your mouth. I'll have my bailiff do it for you. <laughs> What's he going to do? Hit me? What are you going to do? The state would like to call Matsu Takahashi. Mr. Takahashi, could you please tell the jury what your occupation is? I own the golf club. How are Larry David's interactions with the other members? Oh, he's always disgruntled. And also, he never say four when he hit the ball. One time, he hit a member in the back with a golf ball. Oh, my God! Hey! What the fuck? And I understand there was an incident involving some wildlife at the club? Oh, yes. He killed my beautiful black swan, Kyoko. Mr. Swan attacked me. It was kill or be killed. It was was self-defense. Order. So this guy. So this guy. The state is honored to call Lieutenant Colonel Alexander Vindman. Lieutenant Colonel Vindman, I understand you have a long history of uncovering corruption. I reported President Donald Trump when he was uh, sitting president and he attempted to extort in a quid pro quo President Zelensky, who is now fighting a war against Russia. And President Trump ended up being impeached. I continue to expose corruption wherever I find it. And I will not tolerate corruption from Trump, Putin, or Larry David. Oh, come on. Trump, Putin, and Larry David. That's an unusual combination. I overheard Larry David attempting to bribe a Santa Monica City Councilwoman. It was a perfect call! A perfect call! 